Hey other people of the internet, I'm Takara and today you see me hovering over the rivals, right? And uh, today, well, they've defeated 48 out of all the main rivals in the game, which is quite surprising. Considering we haven't beaten all of them just yet, we're still at the start of the, start of the game. Something I've just noticed, pretty much most of the teams on the Shinkanjo, they um, mostly all add up to 7. Except um, Cupid Arrows, which I think is an old girl team. No, I'm thinking of um, of a different team in um, ITC. Something Cats, I can't remember what it was called. Tatex Cat or something? I've actually forgotten, I need to play that game. So yeah, anyway, we're going to um, hopefully finish off um, SS Limited and um, the Rolling Guys. If they can fucking spawn instead of giving us our gangs who go on the wrong side of the bloody... They, they, they're on the seat, they, they, why is... I'm so confused. Why is there an fucking... Well, our gang 86 on the C1 when they're meant to be on the Shinkanjo? I mean, he's probably taking the wrong turn, but you know, I mean, that's how we've been able to take most of these guys out. Oh, fuck. Right, I don't want to race you. Can you, like, fuck off? I'm just going to see if I can drive past him. Yeah, I do... Oh. He flashed me. Really? This this isn't meant to happen. I don't want to race you. <laughs> I've got other people to beat. Fucking hell. Oh my god, the arc sounds so much quicker. I could do with some better brakes. You can't get like newer level tyres though, unlike you can in ITC. Yes, I'm comparing this game a lot to Import Tuna Challenge because in Import Tuna Challenge you can do a lot more to your cars, but there's a lot less of there's a lot there's not as many there's not as big a car selection in Import Tuna Challenge. Which really sucks actually, may I add, in my opinion. Don't get me wrong, it's a fantastic um, game. It's um I think over in Japan it was um the TXR. I don't know, I'll have to look that up. But yeah, it did have um, a separate name. I don't know if there is like, you know, massive differences, but... It's going to fuck off. It, no, you can fuck off. He's really kick, he's really kick, he's holding it. He's a tricy up 7 and, you know... Really, you know... Fuck you, bitch. You know, hold it. Fuck you, man. Anyway. So, yeah. Got the next thing we shot for you guys. The Arc 7. So, uh, yeah. I'm, li I'm literally just recording for like a few seconds li super soon after I recorded the previous episode. Just copy. How do I, um,. You know, get that other thing, the boost. How do you activate that? Or is that... I, I don't know. Ugh. What the fuck? What the fuck was that? Oh shit, there's a wall there. Seriously, I want to know how you activate that. That could be helpful. But I don't... I, I think the... Um, RX-7 doesn't have the ability to do that. I think, I think other cars can, but the RX-7 just can't. <gasps> Are you yes? Fucking hell! Where were you guys? We need to beat you.
Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck's sake. Oh, of course I'm in the wrong lane, aren't I? I can stay on it. Yeah. Also, I'm gonna um, keep the uh, RX-7, the R32 and the R34. But, I'm gonna keep two um, slots spared because apparently you can only have like up to five cars on this game. Um, well, that's what it says when you go onto the um, info list. You can only have five cars, I think. So, yeah, I'm gonna save the other two slots for Wanderers and then just sell them individually when we don't need them. And then once they've beaten their requirements. Oh, hello. The main guys come out. Wait a minute. I haven't, I haven't, I beat Rolling I2 yet. Also, his car in ITC is rice to shit. Because his has like a custom vinyl and everything, which is hilarious. Seriously. It's quite funny. It's not the fastest 86. I've driven a much faster one. <clears throat> My one needs to be 25. That thing's fucking rapid. See, all this time you've been avoiding me, Spirit 6. Because you know, deep down, you're going to get battered. Just like Typhoon is 86 did. No, wait, no, it wasn't Typhoon is lost, it was fucking racing. Fuck! <laughs> it's kind of, it kind of sucks, really. <clears throat> like, I like, if, if I can say one thing about Initial D, I like how they take the piss out of the 86 when they first see it, and the fact that it's practically. Eh? Oh shit! Oh, okay. Both of them have come out to play her. I wondered where the other guy was. I was like, wait the fuck? There's Roland guy too. Wait, you're 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 in the wrong lane, mate. Yeah, Two eight sixes. Cock. Right. Oh my god, the frame rate. Oh my god. Oh my, do not go the wrong way. If you go the wrong way, I'm gonna fucking murder you. I mean, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> what the fuck is that? Get out of the way. There we go, let me show you 86 boys how it's done. FC style. Someone please put a bullet in my head. <laughs> please, put me out of my misery. <laughs> of existence. Oh, Jesus. Well, these boys are both fucked. And we're gonna get some uh, yeah, nice tasty cash prize by beating. Hmm, really? If I have to say, Rolling Guy's. Rolling Guy 1's 86 and this doesn't look as riced out as shit as his um, ITC counterpart. It's so bad. Like, seriously. Like, it's ridiculously bad. I'm gonna have to wait a while. It is so weird. it's like the worst thing I've ever seen. Now I have to wait for the other guy to fucking catch up. Look at me. Wait, does it count them both as separate races now? Yeah, it does. What the fuck? Okay. Well, we're gonna be here for a while until the other guy makes his um, appearance known to the world. He's quite a while away. So yeah, I'm just gonna sit here and I don't know. Look things up whilst we wait for the guy to appear, so
doing this entire time, mate? Seriously. How long did, was I sat there for? I don't know. I might just need to put a timer up to see how long it see how long it takes me to realise how bored I was getting. Ah, so it does work. So it's it's, it's select. It's also going to overcook my engine to shit, but that might be the method we need to use to um, take on Jackknife. Of course, after we take my access limited. I want to take on all these races first before we move on to the next set area, so... How much did that take my own um, stuff up? Oh fuck, hella heights. I've always wondered how it worked. I thought it was only just... ...as much as speed. Seriously, I raced like what? One, two, three, four cars. Four? And there's no one else here to oppose me. It's a chunk. Um. Well, that's not the problem, is it? Well, now that I know what the boost button is, I can use it when I race Jack later on. Oh, stop glitching out on him. Can rub some. I want the attention of an R34 to appear in the next area which we're going to. Oh, fuck you, bitch. One R32. Either or, but I want one of them. But if, I'm, but if I do, if I am able to get an R34, I am going to buy it, but I'm not going to use it. I know that sounds really dumb. Like, you get an end game car before... Well, the end game. Oh, fuck, that's going to... Um, I haven't watched the film, and nor do I give a shit, so... Spoil all you want, but anyway, <laughs> uh, that film ruined the term end game. But you know, because I, I can't remember the R34 is more of an end game car in ITC, and um, so is the Supra. Um, I mean, you can use the Mark III Supra to the end of the game. Apparently, I've not tried it. I, 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 I was going to try it on. Um, I really don't want to race Jackknife, but there's like no one else here. There's seriously no one else. No, I'm not gonna bother racing him. I'm legit not gonna. Because there's no one else there. So, I'm just going to go back out again. Because, like well, I said, there's no one there. Oh, he's gonna fucking want me to race the cunt. I'm just gonna forfeit the race. I don't, I legit don't wanna race Jackknife. Like, he keeps on, he keeps on challenging me every time. I don't wanna race him. Seriously. Every time I come out, he races me. Like, oh, because uh, they're all on the other route, aren't they? Oh, fuck it. Come on. Let's be out of here. See, he's flashing me. He thinks, I didn't flash him, yet he he wanted a race with me. Why? Right, let's see if that works. No. It makes the car a bit more stable. Really weird observation, that, I know, but it genuinely has made the FC a bit more stable. And on that note, fucking, I'm not doing it. Yeah, no, there's seriously no one else to race except that one guy down there. Um, yeah, I just need to just hit the wards. I fucking, you know, I'm not racing. You piss off, Jackknife. Yeah, I've got more important shit to do. Sod off. He challenges me every time. I've, I probably should go to a different park to see one. So then he doesn't challenge me. Hey, God save Dark Side. Anyway, yeah, so I'm gonna resume when I um, catch up to this guy who's still on scene one. Which I'm assuming is an SS Limited racer. Because if he is, then that means I can finally 
begin obliterating everyone else on Shinkanji. Okay. So I've beaten everyone on the outside loop. I need to beat everyone on the inside loop, then move on to Shinkanju, and then go and beat Jackknife. And then probably get another boss of attention. <laughs> and that means I have two bosses to rest up. I mean, the Aaron 7's got the power. Like, I, I know the Aaron 7's capable of, like, beating Jackknife. Like, it was quite capable on that first run. Well, the run that we did earlier in this episode. But, um, yeah, I don't want to raise that one. I don't know, S14, S15, F5, no, S14. I thought it was an S15. It, look, it, look, it has the S15 front end, but it's not an S15, it's an S14. Anyway, that's a good time. That worked. Oh, hi, yes! You fucking cunt. Fuck you, bitch. Uh, oh, fuck. It's gonna take a while for me to actually get there, so I'm calling this out. I might, I could go, I could probably go and make another coffee by the time it's done. Also, if you've got, if you've cut out the hole for, um, you know, dual exhaust, I don't understand why the car doesn't have dual exhaust, I only just noticed that. Seriously, what the fuck, game? Yeah. I mean, I, I mean, I prefer just one exhaust. Yeah, you know, just a single cannon rather than dual. Or quad. I mean, quad cannons are quad. Like the IS, ISF. No, oh my god. Oh, you're somewhere on the other. I'm a different team. I'm not meant to be here. Oh, are you on the outer? <gasps> Fuck me, that was close. I need to kill me, though. All the Pepsi thing, right? It's also a Nissan advertisement on the game. It's called Kiss Out. That's funny. Um, that's quite funny. I don't know. No, not that. Not two. Oh, yeah, it's six. I don't know. Right. Um, we're gonna turn the other way because no, we're gonna stay on C1 because I want to beat SS. And... Fuck me, rip shocks. I think rip the entire suspension. I really the suspension would be dead at that point. You know. So that puts me on the outlook. Haha, I finally catch up to me. Can I just piss off off the map? There you are. Wait, what? You're a Tokyo Jungle? Tokyo Jungle aren't meant to be here! You're meant to be on the Shinkanjo, for God's sake! Again, I mean, I'm not a Shinkanjo racer, but I want an SS Limited. Be a ton of bye bye. I know I'll say that and I'll fucking crash to the bastard highest that's vastly quickly approaching me. Oh shit. What? So, yeah. I'm, I am enjoying TXR3 if I'm honest. I mean, I'm enjoying TXR3 a lot more than I was enjoying TXR0, let me tell you now. Don't get me wrong, GXR Zero is a great game, but I just it just pissed me off. Because A, it doesn't tell you what the um, cars are. I mean, I can tell what most of them are, but I can't tell the Evos apart from each other. No, seriously, I can't. Like, you know, the Evo 8 and 9, I can't tell the difference. The, like, you know, say, the, I can tell the difference between the Evo 10 and, like, you know, its predecessors, like the 5, the 6, and the, but I can't tell the 4, 5, 6, 7. Part, they look exactly the fucking same. You know? It makes like no sense to me. Can I go on the other road? No, not yet. I still have races to be on C1, which I'm not so Can I pass it? Because I don't want to be sat by the fucking mini -way. Thank you. Anyway, I wish um, we could get like another TXR style game, you know, like this, but with more modern handling and a bit less, you know, piss for the NFS break to drift. Like in the whole, you know, break to drift. Haha, it's just another thing. Fuck for that. Um, 
Now, in my opinion, I agree with um, like platformer break to drift. It's not good. Uh, in NFS 2015, I always turned it off because I'm always because well, I've always you know pressed um handbrake, which on um, NFS is it? Correct? I think it's square. I can't remember what it is on it, which is B on um, an Xbox controller. It, it, it's something like that. An X is for nitrous, obviously, because in um other on PS3 um NFS games. It was a um, circle for nitrous, and X was handbrake, if I recall correctly. And of course, the triggers were the, um, you know, the fucking accelerator. And brake. I wish it was like the, I wish it was like this, you know, where X was to, you know, accelerate, square was to break and reverse, um, and the triggers were to shift. I wish you had a bit more customizability in the controls, you know. I don't know about Xbox, because Xbox had um, triggers first. Um, fresh FPS games, sure, but when I first used... Um, on um, When I first um, played NFS on the cover, way back in the day, when it came out, back in 2008, I, um, I couldn't get used to the triggers. I genuinely couldn't. I always thought it was X, but I never realized I was holding the handbrake until I figured it out. It took me a while to get used to it. I, I mean, I know you can change the configuration, but then I got used to the triggers, and I can't, when I go back to playing PS2 games, I want to set it like that. But then playing a PS2 game with a, like you know PS3 slash PS4 um, trigger layout, it just doesn't make sense, you know. Going back to a classic Need for Speed or Gran Turismo or even TXR, like the PS2 versions, without the triggers, it feels alien. But then obviously you get used to it, and obviously piss poor FPS, but you know. I mean, yeah, I don't know, but the thing is, with um, NFS Underground 2 on the second channel, I cancelled that, because after a while there was a little flicker on the screen with the emulation. It, I don't know what the problem was, but there was something wrong with it, because it doesn't happen on this, unless you just get some weird fucking line things, and, I mean, stable, you know, over 50 FPS if you play it like how I do, or, you know, if you, if you can bear 40 FPS and, and low 30s. Like, seriously, it dips, the FPS dips to shit. But anyway, yeah, I don't know. Don't get me wrong, it's a fun game. And, you know, controls are a bit, you know, iffy at first. But obviously, after you get used to them, you're alright. But then you go back onto more modern games and it doesn't feel right. I don't know. I probably shouldn't have had that coffee because a lot of you probably just clicked off the video because I'm ranting about random shit. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I don't know, but yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just in a very talkative mood. I mean, I know it's like 11 o'clock at night by the time I'm at the time of recording this. Fucking I just can't piss off. Um, also, I, I I would actually laugh if someone genuinely, you know, made a count of the amount of times I've said fucking hi ace in this series so far, and by the end of it, it'll probably be over a good couple hundred. It'll probably break the fucking. Just like um, less estimate. Yes, you are. You're a fuck. Yes. Oh, at last. <sighs> See, it's that Pepsi fucking advertising in the, in the background, man. But yeah. I don't know how many of them I've got to be. There's quite a few. Because it was um three when I last checked, and I've just beaten two of them. So, I don't know, four or five. Because I think there's six. There's, this, there's either six or seven. I'm not too sure. But I'm pretty sure there's um six of them. But yeah, anyway, back to um something else. Um what are you gonna do? Feel free to, you know, say how you doing in the comments. And uh, anyway, let me know if you're enjoying TX Arthur. Because, you know, I'm pumping this stuff out, but I don't know whether you guys are enjoying it or not. Just let me know what you guys want to, you know, play on the channel. Because, well, obviously, I'm a bit broke at the moment. I'm not, but, but I am, technically. Because I'm... Ah! Well, that was close. Is that a muck? It's not a muck, is it? It's a fucking... Is that a Lexus? It's got the Lexus lights, but I'm pretty sure it's a Toyota of some sort. Fucking hell, he can shift. Bloody hell. Bloody hell, he's... He's off. He's off on a level. So am I. Hello then, Mr. Um, Toyota Lexus-y thing, which looks more like a Merc, but... 
Ugh, high yanks. Anyway, the fucking high yanks bastards there everywhere. They're even more prevalent than ITC. He, he, he's just crashed. Hi. In a bit. In a bit, mate. I do like the music in this. Like, I like the music in in most um in most TXRs. I don't like it in um Kaido though. It's not very good. I never, I never, you know, like to very And there's a highest guy. Can you come back? Anyway. Hey, we want. I can grab. Sure. Um, everyone's just seemed to have fucked off. Um. Well, well, before we go, we're gonna go on to the Shinkana Journal. I mean, we've beaten everyone here, but I'm on a bit of a winning streak. So you know, let's let's keep it up, boys, shall we? Oh, well, before we conclude this episode. Because the other episode was probably like half an hour long because I fucking had to sit there wait for a fucking sedan to show up. Oh fuck me. Well, I mean, we're going to be down back on the sea one shortly, but, uh, yeah. Let's go and catch up to this guy. You know? Oh yeah, this doesn't matter. It really doesn't. I mean, it's just a divider, really. You'll see him in a minute, anyway. Yeah, oh, I love You look interesting. Let's keep this with a street going, why not? Super tyrant. Um, we're a tyrant apparently because we just keep on obliterating people in RX7. Next thing you know, they're going to give me a name that's a reference to Initial D. I'd actually laugh if they did that, though, that'd be hilarious. Actually, speaking of Initial D, you know, this um, let me, guys, let me know if you want me to do, um, Kaido Racer as well, or TXR um, Drift 2, or something. Or the original Kaido. I don't know. Because we only have the American port on the emulator. So yeah, I'll look that way. Well, we've just gone down to the um, Shinkanda just to make our presence known. And a few other cars know of our presence around here because we kicked their asses and see what. Probably don't know that there's an RX-7, white RX-7 rolling around. You guys might want to stay clear of that motherfucker. He's gonna, he's gonna kick our ass if we're not careful. And you're not wrong, because we are kicking our ass. I'm so sorry. We've batted some eight sixes, and we're about to give more eight sixes. I'm actually kind of sad. It, it's, it's actually rather sad that they're not putting much of the fight. I mean, I know that I'm pretty sure that's just a bone stock eight six, but just rose because he's got a real fucking wing on it. But seriously, he, he, he's getting battered. Bearing in mind my piss poor driving. Oh, he's catching up. Oh, come on. Are you going to crash the tires? Crash the tires. A E O D. Anyway, we're going to go course it. Course out, even. Ooh, we can't. Oh, hello. What the fuck are you? Ew. You look like shit. Now the super tyrant. Anyway. You haven't locked any new parts. Fuck off. Oh, I had 300 horsepower. Oh well. Um, again, I'm just checking things for now. I, I mean, we don't need anything. I mean, we can get some stuff in the dress up shop for the car, but. Am I really bothered? Oh yeah, no, this is a pain in the ass, I'm not gonna do any of that. Can I, like, leave? Thank you. I'm gonna do anything. Um, I don't know what to do now. Um, hold on. Yep. So how many, um, R gangs will we be in? Oh, about four of them. Uh, so, um... Yeah. Like I said, we're going to take on these guys here in the next episode, or start taking them on. Because I don't want to keep on getting fucking challenged by the same boss. 
starting out my nails now. So uh, yeah, be sure to drop in your questions for the Q and A, guys. I'm gonna end the episode here. We've got 20 grand. Um, so yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. Like, like, subscribe, and until the next episode, peace.